everyone, my name is John. I am living in uh, Louisiana currently. Uh, I came to be a Republican in 1993. Uh, I voted for the Republicans during the uh, midterm election uh, during Bill Clinton's first term. I was very much on board with the contract with America. I was very much a supporter of Newt Gingrich, Bob Dole and company, and believed in the traditional platform of the Republican Party that Rush Limbaugh used to talk about, uh, personal responsibility, common sense, all of these different things, rugged individualism, uh, small government, free trade, the rule of law, etc. And I feel like we've strayed so far from that. Uh, the party is no longer the party of uh, common sense and res personal responsibility. It is now uh, conspiracy theories and scapegoating. And so I didn't vote for Trump during the 2016 election, uh, you know, and I think that, you know, in so many different ways through these last three or four years, the party has basically said to intellectuals and to those of us that uh, want decency, we want the traditional platform, they, ba they have basically said, the net effect has been, that you might as well just go somewhere else. That's really what it is. And uh, so I did... Late last year, late 2019, I did register uh, as an independent. I removed my Republican uh, voter registration, and now I'm a registered Democrat because I'm not going to return to the Republican Party anytime soon. And for now, my role as, as a part of the electorate, I feel, is to vote with the Democrats and vote every one of these Republicans out of office and to send a message and to join the independents and the Democrats in, uh, in, in eliminating this problem from our uh, political culture, which is the authoritarianism, and it's a danger. And uh, my wish is that other uh, Republicans will join with the independents and Democrats and vote these guys out of office. And if uh, you live in a red state like I do, and your vote is really going to be a conscience vote, I would strongly encourage you to, to support the Lincoln Project or to support Republican voters against Trump. 